Okay. Okay. Yeah, we can do things like this with snakes at places like a zoo. Um, here at the zoo, at the Darling Down Zoo in Queensland, we know that this is a safe snake. We're looking today at a boa constrictor, only a young one. It's a snake that can bite, but if it bites you, you won't die, but you will cry. It has no venom, but it does have very sharp little teeth. Because we know this is a good snake, we can safely let members of the public interact with it. But if you ever do see a snake that's outside anywhere, irrespective of whether it looks like this or whatever it looks like, if it's not being held by a snake person, don't go anywhere near it. If it's a fair way away, you can actually turn and run away from a snake. You can actually run faster than a snake. As a matter of fact, until there's one behind you, you probably don't know how fast you can run, do you? If there's one really close to you, though, you have a problem. You can outrun it, but you can't, um, can't outrun the strike. So if you're very close to it, within striking distance, a metre or so, maybe a bit more, just stand still. Don't move. Stand like a statue and either call for help or wait for somebody to come and help or wait for the snake to go away. You can scream very loudly, probably make you feel better. Won't affect the snake because the snake has no ears, so it's not going to hear the sound of you screaming. Obviously you'd yell one word, just snake or something like that, and whoever's coming to help you, they'd realise the snake's there, that's the problem, that's why you're screaming, and so they'd be looking out for the snake themselves as they're coming to rescue you. Okay, and bear in mind that in Australia, a country of what, 22 million people, yeah. only about a thousand people a year get bitten by a venomous snake. Australia-wide, out of 22 million, that's hardly any. Mm. Out of those thousand people a year that get bitten by a venomous snake, roughly 1% actually die. Yeah. So around about 100 people a year, uh, around about 10 people a year, I'm sorry, around about 10 people a year die of snake bite in this country. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, don't panic, live and let live, leave and be. If you see one out there, turn around, run away, just leave it alone. Most of the people, 80% of the people who get bitten have been trying to catch it or kill it or hit it on the head or whatever. Had they just walked away and left it alone, they never would have got bitten. Yeah. Here end of the lesson. Thanks very much for that. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Flax is dragon. Okay. How's that feel? Just get on with it, Kim. <laughs> I'm packing it. He's a friendly chap, isn't he? I'm packing it. Just get on with it. <laughs> He's picking by the hour this way. So what sort of snake is this again? This is a boa constrictor. Yep, and he's about what, five years old, is this? He's about five years old. You can touch, he darling. Hasn't anybody Better touch today. him. Uh, ah, 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 ah. The last lady Gentle. who did this gets out of the hospital tomorrow. She's going to be fine, so there's nothing to worry about. Oh, yes, that's funny. Lose a leg or, or, or no, 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 bad circulation. Oh, right. They're really enjoying this, aren't they? <laughs> it's only I feel sorry for the snake when I throw it at them. <laughs> okay. well, what do yeah. these guys eat? These guys, apart from ladies, they eat uh, rats, oh, mice, birds, aren't you? things like that. Sarah, it won't hurt. I'm oh, gentle, darling. You've got to be very gay. Do you want to touch him, yeah. Julie? Uh -huh. No, was that okay? We're getting around there. We're not going to miss you. It's okay, sweetheart. Oh. It's all right. You don't have to touch him. Oh. Grandma was actually seriously packing Thanks, mate. Sister, you're holding a boa constrictor. <laughs> it's like dragon. It's a boa constrictor. I've got this uh, professional snake handling here. And, uh, yeah, this one's about five years old. And uh, for his size, he's got quite a lot of strength in him. He's not an aggressive snake. He's very, um, very gentle. Very gentle. This, this one. Yes. Very classic. Yes. And. Um, Oh, does that actually make a difference? Oh, okay. Yeah, picture of his head there. What's that? <laughs> <laughs> Too much. <laughs> and he actually feels quite cold and clammy. But then the snakes are cold blooded. Yeah. And uh, this is as close as I ever want to get to one. I've had a few tangles with Browns and a few others. This one's not venomous. But it gets any bigger, no, it gets too heavy. And yeah, sometimes they get you get a bit cranky. Yeah. So, uh, Up to five meters. He's nice and gentle, this one. Okay, yeah, mm -hmm. five meters, yeah. Five yeah, meters. Pretty big. Five meters. That's how big it will be. Yes. Yeah. Yep. That's and I'll pick another one up. No. no. <laughs> Anyone pick it up at that size? Oh, you, you need to, more you'd than have one to know person. It pretty well. but... Okay, we're well, yep. right, Thanks. Thanks very much. Yeah.